You're close. But I can't I, go any higher. I appreciate that. Because I honestly yeah. don't think that in the condition that it is that I will get more than like seven, eight hundred bucks out of it. Oh, it'll be a quick sell at that. Dark Star, okay. And then I got some bird shed at the end. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so yeah. some, ouch! Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, oh somebody's <laughs> mad! I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Let's do this. See this coin? Hey guys, Pete over here. Here we go. 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97. And she did it on her own, you know? So, guys, do you know how hard it is to move her from shoulder to shoulder? <laughs> <laughs> it looked quick and funny on a video, but it's definitely a, a project, right? Because she does, oh, there she goes, and then you go like this. That was easy. You did it this time, and now she doesn't want to climb. Come on. Mm -hmm. This time she cooperated really nicely, yeah. So let's get into today's video. You said I can't find them, so I don't know really how much they go for. You said that you know that they're roughly about 90 bucks. Yeah. That's what you were told. Right. Okay. What do you need in your pocket? If you got five of them, what are you thinking? I mean, two? 200? No way. I'm not going to make any money on this. You really don't want to know my number then. I was thinking like, <laughs> no, I honestly was thinking like 10 bucks a piece. Oh man, 10. Yeah, but I don't know what they fit really. And You give me 20 bucks and I'll take it. I'll piece. tell you what, I'll tell you what, let's do this. See this coin, red, green. Green is heads, red is tails. You pick, if I win, 10 bucks, you win 20 bucks. I'll give you then $100 for five of them. Which one you want to choose? Green. You want a green? Yeah. So you want tails? Yeah. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Green. You win. 20 bucks a piece. You got it. <laughs> that easy, huh? Yeah. Or hey, I got something else you might be interested in, too. Okay. They're brand new. Should I bring them in? Bring it in. I'll check it out. So I'm going to drop a couple quarters in my uh, curve slot machine. Jackpot. Come on. Nothing. One more quarter. This. Ooh! One golden nugget. This bank is so full. There's probably like $150 in quarters in here now. So I'm officially taking the um, sold sign off. The back there? Because sure. Brian, who bought this from me from Pennsylvania, I gave him another almost a month to reach out. I sent another two emails. Couple phone calls, no response. Brian, I don't know what happened to you. This officially is back on the market. Uh, and if you're still watching, I have your deposit. I'll work with you. Just if you have a problem picking it up, just reach out. Anyway, this one is back on the market again, and I got uh, I got a couple of people already interested. On the charger, though, it's almost different to the base. I can't find the other base, but this is the original cord. But the cord is the original, right? Yeah. That's fine. No, no problem with that. Is it charged up right now? Yes. Okay. I did a, uh, a console reset on it, so everything's deleted off of okay. there, too. Perfect. What are you looking to get out of it? I was hoping to get maybe 70 or 80 out of it. 70 or 80. Okay. Mm. Honey, don't bite me. <laughs> You want to fight today, huh? Are you feisty? <laughs> um, I tell you what, I don't think I can go that high. I think the highest, the, they're selling on average about buck 20, depending on a color to 120, 124, you know. I, okay. What do you think you can do? 65 bucks. I usually do about half, you know, for, for what I can get for them, so. Okay, you know, 65 is good. I'll that works it. for you? Absolutely. Okay, all right, we got a deal then. Absolutely. I need your ID, I'll write you up. Yes, sir. And I see you got one one game here, huh? Says yeah. Ouch! Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Somebody's mad! 
I've got like three cats and one dog, and they don't, I don't know what's up with her. No, she's usually very, very mellow. I don't know what's up with her. <laughs> <laughs> she was sleeping all morning, too, and all of a sudden it's like. Can I pet her? Go <laughs> for it, all right? <laughs> She's pretty. See, she's nice to you. She's like, <laughs> she's pretty too. Yeah, she's very soft. You know. All right, twenty, forty, sixty-five. Okay. Thank Thanks, you, man. sir. Appreciate I'll, it. I will be back. Thank you. Sounds good. I want to show you guys something really cool that just came into the shop. I did not buy it. It's here on a consignment because I think it's insane. And honestly, I don't think anybody's gonna buy it, especially this time of the year. But I'm standing in front of um, a heater. These are called torpedo heaters. This is a 200,000 BTUs. Most of them that I get are about 80, 100, 150. So this one is already considered big, 200,000 BTUs. But wait till you see this. So check out this monster. I can barely touch it with my arms all the way across. This is insane. This is like eight, I think eight or nine hundred thousand BTUs. This is something that you would see on a NFL football field when the guys are playing in a cold weather and something like this is blowing on them to keep them warm. I did not want to buy it. I took it in on a consignment, but to be honest, I have no idea who would buy this. Unless you have a, like a huge warehouse that you need to warm it up or something, it's pretty insane. Where'd you get that thing anyway? Did you had it for long? Yeah, you I've, said... had it, I've had it for 20 years. A guy owed me money in 20 years. I've had it oh. sitting in my rack. I hardly ever play tapes. This guy's trouble. Just so you know. How bad? Real bad or yeah. just pain in the ass? Both. Okay. I don't want to get in no trouble. With you know what the, I mean? Uh, like, uh, I just see it out there. Yeah. Nakamichi Dragon is the yeah, best that was made, keep, but I'll just keep playing it. You know, either either keep or put it put it on Craigslist, like you said. I am. I'm gonna, maybe I'm gonna fish. I'm gonna fish on Craigslist. You know what I, I mean? I think so. There's somebody in because the of sure. of the condition. It, it's tough. it's rough. I, it's I a parts can't. machine. I mean, you know what? If it didn't play, that'd be an easy sell, but it still plays. Yeah, you I know. know. It plays in that reverse, but it still plays, right? Yeah, so. it still plays. Yeah, yeah. Uh, in the, the heads. Because you can hear it, like when you put a tape and you uh, you flip the tape over to the other side, you hear it sharpening up as that light is flashing. Yeah. So I know that the money part of it is yeah. working. Anyway. If it was cosmetically I in know. a little bit better condition, Dude, I would offer you more It's a lot like my girlfriend. But, <laughs> but I, I can't. The way it sits, no. I can't. I, I... What's your best number on it? I know we're way apart, but... You said 250. I know. I'm putting it up. I'm fishing for a thousand. Make a make another number. I'm gonna get 600 for Ed tomorrow. No, he won't give you 600. He won't. Yeah, he already said he would. Well, then sell it to him. I can't yeah. come up. To well, that. yeah. I mean, right. I listen. I'll, if you want, I double what I said. I'll make 500 bucks. Yeah. You're close. But I can't I, go any higher. I appreciate just, that. Because I honestly yeah. don't think that. In the condition that it is, that I will get more than like seven, eight hundred bucks out of it. Oh, it'll be a quick sell at that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> at that price, you'll sell it in a in a day. So you can have a three day auction and be done. <laughs> well, that's what I should do. Throw it on the auction. I, I don't like eBay though. They take like twenty percent of our money and wow. ship it to California. Exactly. Fuck them. Exactly. So you understand my pain, right? It's not pain, it's just business. So if I sell this, even let's say for a thousand, two hundred bucks goes right to them. Yeah, I don't want, I'd rather give it, I'd rather burn it than give it to them. So, well, that's why I'm here. All right. If you want, I give you here, five hundred bucks. Not even, I'm not even going to talk about two bucks a piece, right? Two bucks a piece, All yes, right. sir. All right. So, yeah, if you want, if, if you can't get rid of it, Everybody? my offer is five hundred bucks, okay? Okay. So, yeah. Yeah, keep that Perfect. in mind. Yes, sorry to take your time. No. Oh, no. Taste. That's what I do, Carol. Yeah. You didn't take my time. Right. I appreciate it because I enjoy this you type of stuff. You have cash here? A check in the mail in seven months. Of course I have cash. Yeah, all right. <laughs> uh, keep that in mind in case I get in a jam. Always cash. <laughs> Always cash. All right, uh, thanks, man. All right, man. Thanks for bringing it in. Yeah. Any questions?
I'm gonna still listen to it too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So the clip that you just guys saw me trying to buy this cassette deck which is made by a company called Nakamichi and the name of the cassette is actually Dragon. It's one of the most famous cassette decks that was ever made for public. Uh, back in the day, I think originally came up on the market in 1981 but it didn't show up on the US market till 1982. And they produced that deck for a solid 10 years, maybe even a little bit longer. It's a three head, three motor deck. I think it was very close to like two grand original price, like $1,900. And then as years progressed, it went over two grand. Um, by late 90s, the companies went into bankruptcy and then they got bought out by some Chinese company that still operates till this day. And they recently started making some amazing stuff again. But Wow, this kind of deck doesn't show up on the market very often, at least in my shop. The first one was probably six, seven years ago in good working order and I did not make a deal. I didn't buy at that time. And this one we couldn't agree on a price as well. It was pretty rough. It was still operational. The other reverse was screwed up on it, but it was still working, but it was missing a bunch of knobs and the whole front was messed up. But boy, if you ever find this thing out in the wild, remember that name, Nakamichi Dragon, one of the best ever made. Yeah, I know, and I don't know how far is this facility in Grays Lake from here. I mean, Grays Lake is at least 40 minutes. Yeah. But I'm tired. Every single day it shows in transit. In yeah. transit, on a truck, scheduled to delivery by the end of the day. And at the end of the day, it's back at the facility. But, but I don't know if it's FedEx that's the issue or if it's AutoZone yeah, that's the issue. Knows. All right, so they're these worth, are... They're worth $400. $400? $400. Well, I, mean, I know Grateful Dead has a huge following, right? Like, yes. people love it. Right here. Uh, um, I think they're stamped on the side, too. So, what does it say here? It's in a Dark Star. Limited edition. What does it say, Fred? Done, done thing. Fringe. Um, all I know is either the original Dark Star. Uh, Gratui control device. That's the record. And then what does it say here? Dark oh, Star. Dark Star. Okay. And then I got some bird shed at the end. <laughs> <laughs> with some uh, with some rust. Problem. I mean, what do you think? I mean, they're cool, but. Give me 100 bucks and a half. 100 bucks? Yeah. They're worth 400. That's well, that's what you say. That's a throwing shit. I'm gonna look it up and see if uh, if what you're saying is right, because if you, if it is, then well, why not, you know? But I'm um, kind of. You got me really curious. I mean, grateful that don't get married. Anything that they put out posters. there that's like I, this. I, I have original posters too. People, people, you know, just love this band. Oh, if you, um, uh, let me go to Souls. Let's see if anything. No, I would go on Google and I'll show you how I found it. Okay, then you're showing me them at Sotheby's. Um, that it was an auction. These are the ones that you uh, Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Oh, then we're going for 500. See that? And I'm sold out of stock. Yeah, but that's, you know, that, that's what it shows, but do they really do, you know? I, eBay they were too, so. How come they don't come up on eBay for me at all? Right, you know? right here. Same ones. Same exact okay. ones. And those are going for 400. That's the ones I showed you. Somebody, yeah, somebody's asking that, you know? So. I'm only asking. I'm oh, that's a warranty. Way less than all that. Yeah. It's, it's not so they, and, and yeah, they, they were 600. That was a buy now. Yeah. And there is 400. I'm only asking. I know how I sell something like cross country. So they they made uh, they made thousand of them. This is number 346. So it's pretty damn low. Yeah. Well, but they're out there. You know what I mean? That's what I'm getting at. So, all right, I'll give you 100 bucks for it. Thank you. I do need your ID. I'll write you up. You know, I should deduct ten dollars for the crap on that. You know? No, that's add it twenty two. Add it, unless it's a fa <laughs> unless it's a famous bird that crapped on it. Right? I need this your autograph is, on the bottom. This is the box. 
20, 40, 60, 80, 100, okay? Different. Thanks, man. You just printed these, right? I did. I did. I do it every morning. I'm out of here. I'll these see you. I'll be back. Uh, what take up till five? Six. Six. These I'll two I would like you maybe to look at. Before we end today's video, earlier you guys seen these uh, uh, Grateful Dead skis that I picked up, the Dark Star edition. They're very limited, but since we are on that subject of uh, Grateful Dead, I want to do a giveaway today. Not of these, but it is a Grateful Dead uh, private pass that you would get to go in a backstage. And this, this is from 1996. So just below down in the description, if you guys are interested of getting this little gem, uh, drop down a comment below saying Grateful Dead. And uh, we'll pick a winner on the next video. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.